Hey everybody, it's Mike. Welcome back to Everyday Barbecue. If you've got a Blackstone griddle, you probably have the grease issue that most people have. And uh, it's no different for me. I bought mine within the first two or three cooks. I was cooking some greasy stuff and um, I had some leakage from the trough. And I contacted Blackstone. They gave me a couple recommendations which did not work. One of the recommendations though was to purchase a piece um, from a company that they recommended which slides onto the end of the trough and supposedly you know um, guides the grease into the cup so I ordered one it came in it did not fit very well at all I had to really struggle and bend it to get it onto the end and I contacted the company they told me it must have been a bad piece they sent me another one right away so that's really good news they responded to me instantly sent me a replacement device I've got it right here. I've had it here for a few days and I just haven't had time to do this test. So here it is, if you can see it. And uh, what I'm gonna do is go ahead and install this and I'm gonna cook some greasy bacon and we're gonna see if this works. So just hang in there. Okay, so I removed my old piece and I have the new one just started here. I had to just bend it upwards slightly just to get it to sort of take the right shape and now all I'm going to do is that right there. And I'm going to crimp it a little bit just to make it tight. Okay, so I've got that installed. I'm going to go ahead and empty that grease can and we're going to do a cook. Now this one went on much easier, I have to say. I did have to bend it just a little bit with some pliers to get it to take shape, but it went on within less than a minute. So certainly looks like the first one was flawed and we're going to go ahead and test this out i'll be back when i have some grease moving around in here and we're going to see if it um, really does what it's supposed to do so just hang tight all right we're back i've got the bacon on i've got a lot of grease here and everything's ready for this test so let's just see what we get put some of this grease down into the trough get a little more and try to really do a test there and we'll see what happens and pour some more yeah it looks like it's working folks let's do a little more Some of this over there. Try to do a little faster just to simulate a real cook because you know how sometimes we don't really pay attention. And this looks like it's working. So I'm not going to keep you much longer. I like that a lot. That's going to save my porch and my marriage because my wife didn't like when I got grease on the porch. So I'm going to continue doing this. Now, if I come up with any other result, I'll film it and I'll add it to this video. So if you don't see anything else, then assume that this device works. And I will post a link in the description. Okay, I'm back. I finished that cook. I've got my griddle top all cleaned and sprayed down. And you can see how much grease we captured here. I mean, this is maybe around half full, maybe a little less. But not one drop um, outside of the trough area. So... This is pretty good. I'm going to do a summary video. I'll be right back. Okay, so we're done with breakfast, kids. I have two co-hosts with me now for this summary video, kids. How was the yeah, breakfast? Good. All right. Uh, anyway, so that worked out really good. I have to say, uh, I had a little blip on the first time that I installed that. I don't think I had a good piece. I think there was a problem. But the name of this company is Backyard Life Gear. And I'm going to put a description, um, a link to to this website for the product in the description of the video so I have to say I recommend it if you're having this problem with um, the Blackstone griddle this is a cheap fix it's cost me like 12 bucks maybe maybe 16 bucks with shipping something like that but uh, not one drop of grease and it, there was a lot there so I hope this helps take care Mike with everyday barbecue please consider subscribing to my videos and I will talk to you soon take care